Hello, everyone, and welcome to another edition of Ask Blood and Sons. I'm Joshua, and sitting next to me, my special guest, once again, is Mr. Josh. Josh, how are you doing today? I'm glad to be back. Good. Glad to be back. So, it worked. Your plea, our plea worked. We've got some questions from you, the viewers, and thank you so much for submitting in your questions. So are you ready? I'm ready. All right, so first question comes from Angela, and she asks, will we see pork jerky back in stores? So I think so. Um, it depends exactly which, which pork jerky you're looking for. Um, I've made a pork jerky that was basically a, a pork loin that we, that we dried down into jerky. Um, it wasn't hugely popular. Uh, but I made another jerky in the in the past that was a little more popular, but we haven't made in a while, and that's a that's a bacon jerky. Um, we made a, we made a maple bacon. Uh, we called it meat candy. Uh, and then we had a we had a jalapeno one, and then a, just a regular bacon. And I have not made that in a while, but I need to because it was it was pretty popular. Um, it, in store only, uh, in store only kind of a, a jerky town exclusive, so it fits in with our jerky town line over there uh, at the at the retail store here in White Deer only. Um, I, I need to get some made. Sounds like it's delicious. I've never had it before, so I want to try it out really yeah, good. So, second question comes from Robin, and Robin was asking about specifically snack sticks. She was asking, are we going to expand the snack sticks flavor? She was specifically asking about teriyaki and maybe some lemon pepper. So, snack sticks is, is one area that we are looking for some growth in in 2021. Um, I'm working uh, right now on some samples of, a, of an all-natural, um, all-beef snack stick um, that's going to be kind of a clean ingredient, um, hopefully hopefully really delicious all-beef snack stick. Um, and then I'm working on um, several others. I've never, you know, I've never tried to make a teriyaki or a lemon pepper stick, but I'm making some test batches this week, so maybe we'll make some. And, uh, maybe we can send some out to, uh, to uh, Robin if we do. Um, for her, for her good idea. Um, but I'm making those. I'm making. What else are we making? We're making a sweet chipotle. Okay. We're making a. Um, what else? I've got a couple. I got a couple other ones uh, that are that are in the works that we're gonna um, play with. And so we'll see. Okay. What comes up. That sounds pretty awesome. And to Angela and Robin, we thank you again for submitting in your questions. And because you submitted in a question and we did ask it on air, you are going to receive a free bag of jerky or maybe even some of those test snack sticks. We'll have to we'll have to see and all or that. Maybe both. Or maybe both. We'll get a, we'll be getting in contact with you so we can get your jerky out to you. And again, thank you for asking your questions. And if you want a chance to get a free bag of jerky, just submit your questions to us at ask at clothingsums.com and if your question's read on air we will give you a free bag of jerky as a way of saying thank you for asking your question absolutely if you if you do get a question read josh emails you and and reaches out and says hey i want to i want to get your jerky to you tell me what flavor you want if if you have had one of your questions answered on here and you haven't received the email you haven't been able to get anything from josh whatever the case may be um, reach out to us. Uh, ask at cluttonsons.com would be a, would be a great email to reach out and let us know that hey, you asked my question, I didn't get my jerky. Let's get it to you. Um, we want everybody that gets a question on here to get their free jerky. Mm -hmm. It has just been a little hectic around here, would you say? A little hectic. Yeah. yeah. This place is, yeah. Is a, well, final question has to do with delivery. We talked about it about a while back about our pickup site, okay. and we were talking about starting delivery. Have we started delivering? We have. Um, so about a month ago, we went live doing um, local delivery on our pickup site in White Deer. So about a month ago, um, we started to where if you if you live in White Deer, if you're if you live in the seven nine zero nine seven zip code uh, at pickup or at, at checkout, you can choose delivery, um, and we'll bring it directly to your house. Um, about a week ago, we added. 79065 into that. So if you live in Pampa, uh, you now have, as of last week, you have the option to get delivery. Um, and that's that's whatever you buy from, from our pickup website. Uh, if you order, you know, if you order a beef pack, we'll bring it to your house. If you if you need, if you know you need some steaks for the weekend, whatever it is that you need, you order it on there and choose choose the delivery option. And uh, we've got we've got one of our delivery folks that will get it right out to you. That is really cool, and especially like if you're really busy on a weekend 
before like a big event and all that and you don't have time to head to the store and you want to get good quality products, just go through the pickup site and you can get something really good. I look for it. I look for it really to take off. Um, the, uh, the, 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 the popularity of, of the different delivery services now, the, the, the yellow truck that drives around and some of the other um, delivery, delivery services uh, have, been, have been hugely popular. It's kind of a it's 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 a little bit different level of, of meat than what we provide uh, with those with those solely delivery services. Um, here we're we're a, a, a butcher shop first and foremost, so you know you're going to get quality meat. We just also happen to deliver some, so as opposed to buying from the back of a truck, you know what you're getting when you get with us. That is awesome. I. Well, I know I won't use it, but I know that a few people that I know really love Clinton Sons in Tampa. So now that they can order from us and get it delivered directly to their door, I think a lot of my friends are going to be ordering from yeah, us. Yeah, it's great for it's great for folks who you know are, are busy and don't have time to get over here, um, as well as as well as you know folks that maybe can get over here. I, I think of I think of uh, a lot of a lot of older folks that maybe don't get out like they used to. Uh, they could they could place a little order and. Bring it right to them. They don't have to worry about getting out and, and trying to get over here. Perfect. Well, Josh, thank you very much for being here. Hopefully, in the future, we'll have Justin back on here again. I know we had a little technical issue with his episode and all that. Yes. And maybe we'll be able to even get Joe or Johnny here. Don't know. We'll have to talk and see and all that. But I always appreciate you being here because you are so knowledgeable about Clinton Sons. And I'm just the guy who works here. <laughs> well, I've done it a long time, Josh. I've been here a long Absolutely. Well, everyone, thank you so much for watching this edition of Ask Clinton Sons. And again, if you would like to submit a question to us, simply submit it to ask at clintandsons.com. And again, you, if your question is read on air, we will get you a free bag of jerky. Thank you, everyone. We'll see you next week. Goodbye. Thank you.